Welcome to another modern gameplay. So today, we're bringing you Grinding Station. <laughs> yes, you heard me. Grinding Station without KCI. So this deck is super fun. What the deck intends to do is to cast Grinding Station and cast Underworld Breach and using your zero to cast mana, which is either Mistress Bubble and Mox Ember, mill your library. So what happens here is that whenever Grinding Station is tapped, sacrifice another artifact. You can even sacrifice itself. Target player mills three cards. So you target yourself. That's three cards that you can use to escape your card, which is probably a Mox Amber. If you have Emery in play, you can produce a blue mana source. And then from there, you can mill your library up until you mill Taza's Oracle. Once you don't have cards in your library, cast Taza's Oracle, win the game. All right, that is actually the combo piece inside this deck. However, the deck actually can win in an alternative fashion. You also have Ragavan, Nimble Pilferer, always the MVP. You also have the win via Dragon Rage Channeler. So there is an avenue for you to just beat down your opponent. And at the same time, you have Urza Saga for those Karn tokens. That's very popular. I mean, this is the trifecta right here plus Unholy Heat. The very, very potent removal right now in Modern Sphere, which replaces even Fatal Push before. Can even deal with Planeswalkers and All-Star right here. Uh, no introduction needed. And finally, one of the best card draws out there, which is Expressive Iteration. No need again. Very good. I believe it's running right now $6 a pop for an uncommon card. <laughs> it's crazy. All right. And that being said, we also have the tutor package, uh, Brainstone, um, uh, Aether Spellbomb, Fighting Needle, Shadow Sphere, and Spring Leaf Drum. Just in case you need that extra mana to cast Aunt Thaza's Oracle, Brainstone to basically do a brainstone, uh, brainstorm um, shenanigans whenever you're getting hand disrupted. All right. That being said, onto the sideboard, you have two spell Pierce and two Metallurgic Rebuke for those counter spell matchups or those matchups against Greek Seas, Lurus. Their mana base is tight, so putting this one and disrupting them really, really can gut punch them. Spreading Seas against Tron. You have your Lightning Bolt as an alternative win condition with your Underworld Breach. So, mostly if you have casted Emery, Underworld Breach, you can actually Lightning Bolt your opponent for three times. More statistically, that's what's going to happen. Plus, you also have your Fetch Lands out there. That's nine damage off of the board and then you can just attack them with Dragon Rage Channeler and Ragavan to finish the game. You have Shatter Spree. Definitely just a sideboard here for uh, or or the respect that Hammer Time needs. Put it there. Tormod's Crypt uh, for those graveyard centric um, strategies or DRC strategies as well. Dragon Rage Claws for red decks. Red deck, red deck wins. And finally, Engineered Explosives as a catch-all for those pesky rest in peace cards or those types. Alright, that that's it. Monkey against monkey. Looking at our opening hand, we do have the Underworld Breach in our win condition, which is Taza's Oracle, but anything else I think is a sub R. So we're going to mulligan this uh, precisely because I know that the deck has um, better turn one drops, plus our opponent doesn't have, I think doesn't have a companion per se. Alright, this one definitely better. I'm going to keep this and then I'm going to bottom the Thaza's Oracle because we don't need it as of right now. It's red. Oh. Goblin Guide. Goblin G! Okay, thanks for the Scalding Tarn. I'm gonna take that damage. And drop. We're going to go to begin combat. Ooh. Fetch. Let's not um, take too much damage. So I'm gonna go with Mountain right here. The Power of Ragavan. Because we have Mox Amber. So I can Unholy Heat the Goblin. Ooh, Castle Ember. Mog Fanatic. Okay. Is it a Mog deck? Okay, not for you. But okay for me. Four cards in hand. Oh, it's a goblin deck, I see. That's a Emery. So I can start by casting Emery right here. Shock Emery. Or I can just go Scalding Tarn. Fetch for a blue source. Uh, let's um, make sure that we got that uh, stuff. Okay, let's see our shadow. Oh, Shadow Sphere, I need that. You gotta live, Emery. You have to live. <laughs> You gotta live like we're dying. Can't believe how. Don't die. Pile driver. Ooh, protection from blue. Okay, okay. I respect that. Luckily, our removals are not blue centric. That's an underworld breach. Right. So I have a shadow sphere right here. So I can go. Um, let's go for expressive iteration. That's a free card right there. That's blue, red. Oof. Want to hand. Uh want to um pick one of them to your hand. One of them to the bottom of my library, one of them to exile. 
here's my land i'm going to shock yes here's me shocking that in that's too much damage here's me bringing back the shadow sphere play the shadow sphere and i will pass the turn all i need now is a grinding station and we win <laughs> okay battle cry goblin okay let me just uh here this one out um all goblins get plus one plus zero and hate whenever goblin cry attacks if you attack with a creature with total bar six or greater some plus one red goblin token stopped and attacking okay okay respect that respect i'm gonna take this damage let's go to main that's drc uh that's five types here here's my saga Okay, first I'm going to attach you to this creature, this one, so that I can uh, deal you damage. I gain two life because I don't have anything, anything to recur here, and equip it here. Blue, blue, F6, go. Just looking for that. Um, just looking for the grinding station, and we're all set, guys. Loyalist, haste. Okay, okay, I see. Uh, they're missing for a land drop right here. Missing land drops is quite bad. Okay. Mog fanatic, mog fanatic. I see. Okay, they're going to attack three of them. It says whenever. Okay, they're, nope. They're going to attack. Cool, cool. It's a Ragavan. Ooh, okay. This one surely has to attack, right? Surely has to attack. I have a Ragavan as well. Uh, four. I'm gonna take four damage. Put down four. And drop. Here's a... Can I just go for double unholy heat and win the game? Uh, I don't think I have enough for double unholy heat though. I don't think I have enough for unholy heat. Double unholy heat. Because I can la I drop the uh, underworld and then unholy heat twice. And that's something that we can do. But we need to have a land. Um, yeah, let's let's try to do that. Um, let me cast this. So that I can do red right here. Next turn. I got a blocker. And I think that's mostly what we can do. Okay, let's go. This one becomes a 3-3. Three, three. Four, four, five, five. Yeah. Okay. Goblins. A lot of damage. Okay. So they draw a card. They trigger. First strike, haste, trample. So I'm going to create a creature. Right here, go to blocks. Let's block. Wait. What is the Legion Loyalist say? Can't be blocked by to by creature tokens this turn. Oh, okay. I see. I see how it is. So I think I can. Can I block with Emery somehow? It's one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm down to nine. Hey, okay. sure. Sure thing. I think that happens. Hmm. Think about this. Yeah. The blocks. Okay, down to nine. Let's put a stop set on our draw step. Bro, that's a DRC. So I can just go create something, search, then shoot, shoot. They have a lightning bolt. They don't have a lightning bolt. That part I like. I'm gonna go okay. Let's search for something. It's going to be A. Let's go for A. Ember. Gonna keep this. And from there, Underworld Red, Red, Underworld Breach, Surveil, put to the graveyard. Drop. Bring back Amber, cast Amber, cast, yeah, put to the graveyard. Amber. And from there, I can Unholy Heat. Let's shoot the, this one. Exile 3, let's go for lands. Go for another one. Exile three. Let's go for lands again. One, two, three. Then, okay. Down to four. That's a mountain. Go to main. Can I play the mountain? Nope, I cannot play that mountain. And then I can unholy heat one last time. Let's target something. Uh, this one. Let's go for land creature and unholy heat. Okay, put into the graveyard. Don't need that. Okay, your turn. Okay. Looking good. Go to the sideboard. Hmm, against their deck, eh? So I I would be incentivized to put in some engineered explosives against their deck. They're a go wide uh they're a go wide strategy, so we're going we can put in some explosives. Plus I think they will probably put in some sort of like graveyard hate. Engineered explosives that basically clips them all. Um I don't I don't like having the ether spell bomb right here. I don't think they have one big creature, I think per se. Or maybe a Python needle might be bad here. I haven't seen any um you know 
vials. So vials nowadays, it was seen as it's actually a bit bad to play vials nowadays. So I'm banking on that instead. Um, let me just also, they, they didn't see grinding station, but I think they would be prepared against a graveyard centric deck. So I'm, I will probably shave one grinding station and a underworld breach out there for two lightning bolts. Mismatching arts, uh, of course. <laughs> I don't know why, but okay. Weird flex, but okay. Um, other than that, do we want to have... Because if Underworld breach into Lightning Bolt a while ago, that could have been like 12 damage. That's also a, a different contingency play. Um, that's also a heads-up play, actually. We have uh, a Brainstorm might be the weakest card right here. And then 61 cards. We're playing 61 cards. But looking at our hand right now, we always have this weird Thassa Oracle hand. And... Uh, um, we only need a grinding station. Also, we're on the draw, so we, we we can we can risk to keep it. But because they, I'm going to mulligan this. We don't have early interaction. This one I like this better. We're gonna keep. Obviously, we're going to bottom one. Uh, Emery. We have an early interaction in the form of lightning bolt. So hopefully that pays off. Plus, um, engineered ex uh, expressive iteration is really good. We're going to play. Go to main. Calding Tarn. Uh, I don't see any reason for us to be in a hurry. If they cast Pile Driver, I can just Lightning Bolt it. Um, Mog Marshall. There's Echo as well. Um, our Engineered Explosives would would clear that one up real nicely. We're going to fetch for our Steam Vents tapped. Oof, that's another Emery. There's an argument for me to go Emery, uh, land drop, land drop Emery. Because next turn, they would probably go, um, don't pay the Echo Berserk. So yeah, that's also a heads up play. Let's try to do that. That we can take care of their zero to cast. And we also have an Emery. Okay, we have a grinding station. And we're off to the races. I only need, um, okay. So we only need um if we can, if we are able to cast grinding station we only now need the um, uh, whenever another red a creature enters the foundry gets plus one pleasure until end of turn okay oh okay it's kind of bad go to main let's cast another engineered explosives and cast it for one red i uh, cancel let's put land cast it for one and then that's it there you go we have two expressive iterations, but next turn, uh, I would probably we would probably be safe this turn if they attack. Yep, we're going to take two damage. Denizens are down. Yeah, we're gonna take two. I think I need to put a stop on the beginning of their combat step just in case going forward. Because if they went with Ember Cleave, we not a good position for us. Okay, go to main. Okay, the, uh, the position right now, we are in a very good position, I would probably say. We have Lightning Bolt for this and a um, Engineered Explosives. If they cast something and then I just Lightning Bolt it anyway directly, we, we sort of win. So I can just land drop here, cast it again. We can Engineered Explosives for, for 1 or for 2. That would have been a mistake, I think, because it's 0 to cast. can go for 1. Okay, let's see. Grenade at me, that's fine. That's also fine. Hopefully, their hand is just not stack of grenades. Go to main. Let's dash the Ragavan. Okay. Okay, that's something good. Let's go to main. I can cast it as well. Go for expressive iteration for now. Oof. Lightning. Um, one to my hand, which is a lightning bolt. One to the bottom of my library, which is my win condition, Tassus Oracle. And one of these. You can exile that. That's no problem. Okay, that's kind of okay. Go. Just hope that there's no third uh, or double bolt. No bolts, please. Oh, that's a land. Might be a good um, indicator for us. Might be not. Destroy a target at artifacts. Mash to smith ruins. We're down to three. Okay. And none. Okay. Go to main. We really need... Um, I'm looking for our win condition, which is we want to top deck. What do we want to top deck? We want to top deck. How much is this to cast? Two to cast? The grinding station? Uh, how do we win? So is there a free mana? We need to fade one more. Let's start with the iteration. Oh, none of these matters. So put one to my hand, DRC. Put one to the bottom of the library. Put one exile. So we cast this. Okay. This is a DRC. This is a Ragavan Dash. Ooh. 
Ooh, okay. It's kind of cool. We're going to cast their veil, put into the graveyard. It's not what I want to see. Hopefully, no direct damage for three. If they have it, they have it. <laughs> oh, no. That's a Mog Fanatic. Okay. And what's the last card? Oh, it's a grenade. Okay. They got us. Mog grenades for days. Okay, I see. I see how it is. So it's a direct damage. Do we Dragon's Claw might be a good idea. <laughs> oh, I didn't see that. Uh okay, okay. I see. I see. So maybe we can shave a unholy heat. I saw some uh, graveyard late in the Thor mode script. We can uh shave that off. We're gonna go a bit um do we want to be yeah, I think it's okay. Take care of their stuff. Let's go with the beat down plan. So that's the plan. The plan is beat down. Do we have any life gain aside from Shadow Sphere? That's it, right? Yeah. Rebukes might be good. Spell bomb might be bad. Maybe some spell pierce would be great. Spell pierce. Let's see. If that works. Mid okay. Uh okay. We're gonna keep this at the power of the dragon claw and um dragon claws. <laughs> keep. <laughs> I'm a simple person. I see Dragon Claw, I keep. <laughs> dragon Claws, Underworld Breach. I think we only need some um, interactions. Uh, we also have Engineered Explosives here. Hopefully it's it's good enough. What I really want to see is another land. So if they go Mog Fanatic on turn turn two, uh, turn one. Um, so they mulligan down. Land drop, F6, go. Okay, Mountain. Oof, Mog Fanatic. Thickness. Okay. Oof, go to main. Here's my saga. Here's my dragon's claw. Here's my Mishra's bubble. Wanna see what's up? Okay, another bug fanatic. Quite nice. Nice, 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 nice. I'll keep withdraw. Hopefully that's a land. Grinding station, eh? Okay, I think we almost got it. Yeah, we, we have the win here, I think. Okay, yes. Picker, take two damage, or land please. Perfect, that's what we wanted to see. Now we can start with the Scalding Tarn, and fetch for a island. Hmm. Okay. So my issue here becomes, I need to cast this so that it becomes a 3-3. Three, three. If I expose my grinding station right now and they smash to smithereens it, we are very much in trouble. If they overcommit the board, that's what we really wanted so that we have engineered explosives. Okay. Otherwise, I win actually if I just go grinding station, went grinding station, grind myself, land drop uh, or mox drop grinding station again. Okay. Okay. We're gonna smash to smithereens my, my thing. Okay. Total blocks, lightning bolt gain. Fourteen, bro. Unholy heat. Okay, I can just go do this thing. Then search another one. Okay. Huh. We are somehow in trouble. Deep in trouble here. Not really. We're fifteen, right? Mhm. Mm and I know one of their cards in their hand is a goblin fanatic. Fanatic. In one more. Yes. Bushwhacker, yes. Okay, I'm gonna take this damage. We need lands. Bring leaf into A. Land, okay. That's a start. So, we can grind into Oblivion or I can just go land drop explosives. Their next draw is that card. We're gonna take Unholy Heat. Red. Go for red. Uh, go for dragon's claw. I think we can still survive one more damage. One more. It's functionally minus five. I think to attack. This pump for three. Here's my unholy heat to you. Say yes. Okay. Say yes. Then. One more land. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay, I think we, we pull it through. Go to main. Here's my engineering explosives for one. Pass the turn. Three minutes to play. I think we got this. Sure. And sure. What was that? Normal script. Okay, fine. Here's my land. Here's me Ragavan dashing. Yes. Yes. Back. Oh, oh, yes. Yes. That's the turn. 
Okay, three minutes to play. Here's my main. Not the main. Here's me going with uh, Underworld Breach. Ah, okay, here's me doing the grinding station. Then later I can go Underworld Breach. That's the turn. Here we go. Uh, no. Okay, then it's in. Yes. Yes. So that's a DRC. Let's go to main. Here's my breach. Yes. Yes. So let's cast Mistress Bobble. One. Actually, let's cast Ragavan. Let's go. Oh, one, two, three. Say yes. Say yes. Go for Bobble. One, two, three. Okay, uh, yes, go for mill me, sacrifice you. Then I can lightning bolt this. I don't know, we can cast the mocks. Yes, then I can go lightning bolt. Yeah. Yes, yes, okay. And then, um, that's it, that's my turn. Go. Yes, yes. Draw, draw the main. Here's my land. Here's my DRCs. Oh no. Go to main. Always yes to the trigger. Always yield to the trigger. Yes. 30 seconds. That's the turn. Okay. No, seven, seven seconds. Ah, there's a bummer. We lost this one because of the time. That sucks. Uh, yep. Unfortunate. Uh, but still, I think I'm going to count this. This one I'm going to, going to keep. We have Ragavan, Emery into uh, Amber. Definitely, we're gonna keep. All right, let's go. We we actually won. Uh, game one. Unfortunately. We ran out, of, ran out of time. So if we're, we're going to watch the VOD again, I'd probably say that we we won. Our opponent is a Larus deck. I'm going to land drop fetch shock, I think. Or nah, let's let's just land drop fetch for a mountain and then uh, let's go for white border because nobody does that. We're going to cast that. Mox Ember and Shadow Sphere. Okay. Opponent is now thoroughly confused. Now that he is thoroughly confused, we can strike fear from on their hearts, hearts of men and elves. So it's either you. So it's either you. Um, we're probably facing. Um, they're gonna burn uh, Ragaban, probably. Draw a card. They drew a card. I'll keep they're going to do nothing. Okay, that's kinda cool. Go to main. Go to combat. We're going to attack you. I'm not even going to equip because I know you're going to burn it. Sure. Burn. Okay, here's a land drop. Here's a fetch. Here's a shock. Here's an emery. Here's a Ragaban. Pass the turn. Yep, that's what type of deck we are. <laughs> Baby, I like I like it when you call me Big Paw. Paw. Who needs Who needs Lurus when we have Emery? <laughs> We're going to start it off definitely by casting the Mistress Bobble here. Opponent is taking their sweet sweet time. They're trying to figure out what deck this is. <laughs> Let's see if they show some chats. Nope, no love on the chat. Okay, calling Tarn. Okay, okay. Draw card. Go to main. Bubble. Cast the bubble. Attack with Ragaban. 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 Okay. Not going to equip you with. Okay. <laughs> We're down in the lock. We're going to go. Should we show them? Yeah, I think we can show them. Go grinding station. Yeah, no. Here's me grinding you. Uh, cancel. They want to do that? I don't think so. <laughs> Not right now. Okay. Yeah. Always, always yes. Always yes. Always. Okay. Not going to get something that you want to. You, you can get thought seized for. Okay, show. And then now I just need to have a what you call this? <laughs> um a uh breach and we win. <laughs> sure. Call against command. Uh artifact destroy. I mean okay, sure. I wanna see your next roll. It's another down in the lock. And holy heat into a Iron Mesa. Yucks. Not the cards that we wanna see, but okay. Weird flex, but okay. Uh kinda sad that we're up on this type of deck. <laughs> Ah, oh, I kind of feel bad that we lost the thing a while ago. 
Okay, cool. Going to fetch. No, we're going to cast here. Shoot you. Okay. Okay, that's a needle. What can we needle for? Mistress Bubble. Go to main. Let's go for needle. Fetch. You're going to counter this? Mishras bubble. Okay, go. Six. Now I just need my lands. <laughs> I want to take three damage here. They're down to nine. One card in their hand is a down in the lock. What we're hoping to get here is um, Urza Saga. That's the thing that they don't have. Three. Bring back the dude. Yeah. Ooh, baby. Okay. Ah, I really want this to resolve, yo. But I don't think we will be able to. Go. Cool. Mm-hmm. You can do that. Good luck, forgot about this. The shadow, the last card is a bubble. So four, five, six, seven, eight. An expressive iteration. I think we can try to express. Let me go this. Go to main. Let's try to express. Expressive iteration. Ah, oh, they're gonna counter this. Ah, uh, okay. That sucks, but okay. Sure, 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 sure. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. I see, I see, I see. I still have a land drop though. So I can go grinding station. Oh, oh no, Ragavan, Ragavan to my hand. So that I can, I can uh, counter. Or man, that kind of sucks. What to my hand? One to the bottom of the library. One exile. Yes, drop this. Okay, cast a Ragavan. Come on, baby. Let it happen. And whip. Yeah, you gotta lick it before we kick it. Down, down the lock. Sure. Uh. Da -da 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 boom. Oh no. That's a seven, 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 eight, nine, ten. Okay, they got us. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yeah, they got us. They got us. They got us. Concede the game. They got us here. That was a seven, seven. Oh. Shucks. Not a good look, not a good look for us. At least they didn't see the combo, <laughs> the combo-licious. Injured explosives definitely are in. I like that going in. Um, Maybe lightning bolts are also great. Unholy heat is kind of meh. I don't think they have um some sort of... So I would probably remove the brain uh, spell bomb because there's no big biggies that I want to remove as of the moment. Maybe brainstorm. Brainstorm is like, why? <laughs> okay, I guess. Weird flex, but okay. Um, Other than this... I like I like these the trifectas. Uh what else can we remove? I mean we can also go for a spell pierce here and there. I think needle is gonna okay, but honestly, uh it's kinda bad. Alright, let's remove that. Hopefully we got something. Or we can go Python Needle and uh we'll shave one ragaban. Maybe that. Or put in some spell pierce instead of like lightning bolts. Hmm. Do I remove incorrectly? We're gonna mulligan. Oh, this is bad hand. This is bad. This is bad. Mulligan. Okay, okay. Keep two cards, Lightning Bolt and the extra Emery, right? I want to turn one Ragavan so that I can turn two Emery. <laughs> oh, five cards. Not a good look, guys. Hopefully, they don't have a turn one answer to my Ragavan. And if they do, oh, we're screwed. <laughs> okay. Oh, they also mulligan to down to five. Cool, cool, cool. Arid Mesa, fetch shock. Yes, here's my Ragavan. Here's my bubble. Six, go. I've casted the bubble so that they can't thought seize it. Um, so their only option is to uh, answer our Ragavan. Land drop, go. Okay. Main combat. Let's see if they have anything here. Yes, they do. Shock. Root Ragavan. Okay. Land drop, Emery. Mistress Bubble for days. And that's already Delirium for my Dragon Rage Channeler. Can be lightning bolted, but at least <laughs> you know what I mean. We're going to start cycling bubbles for days. They're going to shoot our Emery down. <laughs> no, not the Emery. Oh, okay, Ragavan Dash into a bolt. Yeah, I mean, the upside of them getting something from me is gonna meh. Devilling. That's an Emery. They can cast the Emery as well. So oh god, they have Delirium. They cannot cast it though. But they have to shoot down my Emery. You can only have enough Unholy Heat. Uh, okay, that's a Dragon Rage Channeler. Going to be me. Looking your top card. It's a Ragavan for days. So that's why I didn't block your Ragavan. Go to main. Draw card. Draw card. Stick up. Yeah. Cast it again. And drop here. Cast you. And drop here. Cast you. Wanna see what's up? Ooh. On top, on top, on top. Yeah, yeah. I like that. Go. <laughs> Go, shoddy. <laughs> 
It's your birthday. I'm gonna keep that. Yeah. Croxa. Sure. Oh, I forgot about big Croxa. Big Daddy Croxa. That's why, that's why we we auto. Land drop, shock, ragavan. Pass the turn. Go to main. We're going to do this. Ooh, down in the lock. Not so great. Yeah, very good uh, top decks, guys. Ooh, that's another bubble. Let's go to main. Then drop. Bubble. Cast bubble. I like the lightning bolts. Put on top of the library. Here's me bringing back the... Yeah, casting it again. Put on top of the library. Here's me. That. Okay, I know that that's a drown in the lock. Attack you. Down to nine. Okay. Not hard. Uh, okay. So, do we really want this to resolve? If I bolt it, yeah, I'm just gonna take it. It's fine. <laughs> yep, this dilemma again. Sing it for me, Nelly. So they're functionally down to down to six, but they do have a um, drown in a lock. So they either down in the lock my uh, Dragon Rage Channeler or my Emery. Emery just generates me like basically Emery says draw two cards every turn. <laughs> Dang it for me Nelly. Which did they target? They target Emery. Okay. Oh they like the thing on top? Let's see what was that? What was that? Oh, me. oh that's a fatal push. Okay. Touch. Down to eight. Nope. Draw a card. Oof, I hate that. Go to main. Draw another card. Oh, oh, why am I mana flooding? No. Go to attacks. So the other one, the first one is a fatal push. So I can just land drop here. Since they have fatal push and then they can um, bring back Crocs. Huh? They're going to fatal push my... Um, here's how what, it, what would happen. They're going to fatal push whatever I'm going to... Um, Create with my Urza Saga because it will block their Dragon Rage Channeler. <clears throat> going to create a blocker. We're going to block your DRC. You're going to Fatal Push right here. Fatal Push. Okay. Okay. We're going to take that damage. The last card is a Ragavan in their hand. Sure. You're going to bring back Croxa. Here's me with a lightning bolt to the face. You die. Okay. Yes! That's how we do it, people. Go to sideboard. Stormward script. <laughs> with the pimps in the crib, ma. Yeah. Okay. Fighting needle might be bad. <laughs> okay. Stormward script. Um, Amber. Bubble. Kinda okay. Kinda okay. Did we board out a Ragavan? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. Oh. Do you want to have a metallic rebuke on deck instead of the spell pierce? Nah, I think spell. Oh, baby. Okay. I, 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 we can live with this. We're gonna keep. So, I will drop all the things. Tragedy because I don't want it to get out seized. It's a Ragavan. No. We need to have a removal. Lightning bolts, please. I'll keep your face. Okay. Go to main. Knock. Ember. Casts you. Cast you. And I want to see what's up because I wanted to. Oh, that's a not, not holy hit for them. Why? I'm gonna do it on the upkeep. It has to be. Oh, Shadow Sphere. Oh, that sucked. That hurt. That hurt very much. That did hurt. That did hurt. That hurts me the most. What hurts me the most is that um, they drew the unholy heat and we didn't. <laughs> and they have the Ragavan uh, dash right now and they can now create the treasure uh, and then this is the removal that we are looking for oh no that's Scalding Tarn okay perfect DRC okay something good oh let's go to main here's a land saga here's my shadow sphere question mark here's my emery <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh no! They saw! They saw the underworld! Underworld breach! <laughs> oh! They know it! Oh, no! Don't do it! Don't do it, you monster! Okay, sure. Get all the lanes that you need. I wonder what's that? Thormod script! Oh, that was ours. But okay, kinda makes sense. Kinda makes sense that they would draw it. Definitely the, uh, the classic maneuver for um, these types of decks. Classic. El Clasico, as one would say. Okay, okay, okay. Classic maneuvers. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Classic, classic. Oof, when it's cold outside. Go to main. 
It's worth two. Okay. So the question here becomes if I dash the Ragavan. So let's go for red. I'm not going for red. Where is my oh no. Go for red. That's this bad boy. Okay. Mm-hmm. Four cards, one of which is I hope that they're mana flooding right here. <laughs> That's my hope. What else can we search for with this saga? <laughs> Bubble. Try to recoup. That's a Croxa. Okay. We'll show them a grinding station. Okay. 3-3 three, three flying. Okay. Another Croxa, I assume. They need one card though. This is 5 to escape, right? Or 4 to escape. Yeah. Exile 5 other cards. We need another card. Yeah. The DRC again. Oh, we really need a... Okay, gonna take that 3 damage. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. They're gonna cast the, the thing. The dragon. Okay. Measure's bubble. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Going to create the dude. Big dude. That's a 3-3. Three, three. Go to main. Oh, that's also a bubble. Let's go for another big dude. That's a 4-4. Four, four. Go to main. Okay. Let's search for a ring leaf from. Here's a bubble. Here's me attaching, equipping it here. Pay one. Pay another one. And we're going to attack. Gain 7, down to 5, sacrifice, look at your top card, that's a bubble, cast it again, cast the bubble, 6, go, oh, we're going, Isa, you're down to 5, uh, you top deck a bubble, now what you gonna do, attack with your Lurus, that's the best thing you can do. <laughs> Oh, so good. Shadow Sphere. This two needs to attack immediately. So either they come back with a Croxa right now, make it skip, and then uh, do their shenanigans with the bubble. Yeah, sure. Take it. I take it like a man. Or the saga. So. We're going to Ibiza. Do -do 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 -do. Whoa. Back to the island. A beautiful man. Whoa. <laughs> Come on. Come on, baby. I'm not I'm not gonna crack. Depending on what they have what they do here. If they top out, I'm going to crack our mistress bubble, I think. So they, they want it on top. They're going to draw it during my turn. Hmm. So it depends clearly now what they're gonna do. They're going to pass the bubble again. Draw two cards. So now if they don't flash back Roxa, I'm not going to, I'm not incentivized to do anything. I'm just gonna do um, Bubble. That's a Death Shadow. 8-8. Eight, eight. Be mine. Okay. What else do we have? Okay. I want to see what, what, what you kept on top. Wow, well, that's a Culligan's Command. I need to draw first, please. I should have drawn first. So, two damage and here. Okay. 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 Go with the grinding station. Oof, iteration. That's an Emery. Ah, oh, that's painful, my, my, my man. Painful, my dudes. Stop. Fetch. For island. Beautiful, man. We can straight up iteration. Shoot down the Lurus. Impressive iteration. Lightning Bolt, Grinding Station, and Urza Saga. Ah, uh, okay. okay. Let's go for one to my hand. Bottom, Lightning Bolt. I should have, I should have went with, uh, let's call this. Put it down. Here's my Emery. Ah, oh, sucks. Spell Pierce is on the bottom. Wait, I'll push the Emery. Okay, another expressive iteration. Our answers were just too late. Opponent was running hot. Okay, Mishra's Bubble. I'm gonna bubble again. Ah, uh, they, they were able to steal our one-off Mishra's Bubble. It's kind of sad. Really sad. Yep. Mm -hmm. I mean, there's still outs here. I can still top deck the card that we need, hopefully. Then win from there, if we are able to do it. Like, I can still go um, top deck the... Okay, go to blocks. Sorry, Ragavan. That was cool. Not cool enough. Okay, I needed to draw. Hopefully they don't have any more counter spells. But they're down to five though. They have to oh we still haven't we have a, a window here. They're down to five. Two cards in hand, one fatal push probably. Terminate, which will you be targeting? Emery. Sure. Emery is down. 
Emery is down, okay. So that last card better be a removal or we win. Or the last two cards should be very much a removal or we win. That's a bubble. I'm gonna go to main. That's expressive iteration right here. Best thing that we can do is a removal or or that. <laughs> okay, so I have a spell pierce. Put one to my hand. Put one at the bottom. Cast this. Cast. Cast. Drop. Six six, you're down to five attack. Oh baby, that one off spell pierce left. You did though, right? Okay, okay. What's that last card? Come on now. <laughs> Get clapped! Get clapped! <laughs> oh. Yo, this is crazy. It has been five games. All five games, we only have one Thaza's Oracle in the deck. Every time there's there is a Thaza's Oracle in our opening hand, the chances are very slim at a 61 card count, right? If I review the VODs right here and I'll just post the the what you call this uh the results, I think I will be blown blown away with the statistics. But looking at this, I don't think I will be keeping this. Is a one land hand hander. We are on the play, we're gonna mulligan this. This is even worse than what we had a while ago although there's two cards here but there's a win condition here in a form of like um the world breach into grinding station game i'm gonna keep the bottom this done i mean okay and drop go let's see okay something funky canopy vista okay six go let's see go to main under nope not the underworld breach but grinding station Six go. Uh, yes? Question mark? Okay. RG. Green, white. Oh, baby. Okay. We're off to the races. That's a Python needle. The one that we bought them a while ago and then we shuffled again. Nice. We can go grinding station. Okay. Yes. Okay. So the question for me becomes, can I do it already? This is have sacrifice an artifact, mills three cards whenever an artifact enters the battlefield, you may untap grinding station. Can I look at my card, my hand? This bubble. Let's see what's next. Okay. I don't like it per se. I'm gonna mill. Sacrifice here. Okay. Unholy heat. Thanks. Too late. I need lands though. Destiny spinner. I'm going for another Weaver. Okay. That's an Emery. Okay. I think we can still have something uh, akin to doing something here. We can cast the Emery right here. Oh, no, we cannot. We can cast the Piting Needle first. Um, we're going to go Destiny Spinner. Okay. And yes, here's my Emery. Okay. Then from there, I'm going to pass the turn. Then we win next turn, hopefully. If they don't have an answer to our graveyard. F6. Massive amount of mana. Journey to nowhere. Targeting our Emery. Okay. I guess. <laughs> to A. Or. Destiny Spinner. Destiny Spinner. Wow. There's a lot of spinners. Okay. I think we... I think we win. That's a Ragavan. Can we... Ragavan dash. Go to main. Okay. Let's think about this. So... Is there a way for us to... To win? No. I think... I think we have to have Emery. I think I have to have a land though. And holy heat right here. Because it's going to be only red, right? Here's my Ragavan casts. Okay. Hopefully they don't have a... Top deck here. That's good. Hopefully it's just land. Yes. It's just land. <laughs> We're gonna take this damage. Okay. That's an expressive iteration. Let's go to main. Okay, so let me think about this, right? If I have... Do we have the win condition right now? Um, Maybe. So I have an extra 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I think we can still wait. Wow. Wow. To my hand, bottom, and then you. Exile. Because I need one more land. Okay, journey to nowhere again. Now I need another land. We just need one more land though, right? Yeah, I think we just need one more land. Then we win. Land please. Arid Mesa, finally. We're gonna go to main. I'm going to fetch. Let's go for red. I don't think it would matter too much. Here's my unholy, uh, unholy underworld breach. Here's my Emery. We're casting that her off first. Exile three cards. One. How do we make this bigger? Okay, okay. So that's one, two, and three. That... 
Cast Emery. Get the thing. We're going to cast a Mox Ember. Exile three cards. One, two, three. Okay. Going to float for blue. We're going to grind me. Plus you. Okay. Then we're going to do it again. Always yield. Always yes. Always yield. Okay. We're going to do it again. Cast it again. One, two, three. Okay, now it's going to be blue again. Target me. Sacrifice. Okay, now I can go bubble for, for days. Done. Then me again. Sacrifice. Then do it again. <laughs> Two, three. Exile those. Blue. Me again. Sacrifice. More executing the combo. Okay, again, 18 cards. Taz's Oracle is right there. Let's not exile it. <laughs> One, two, three. Blue again. Exile sacrifice. Let's go for um number again. One, two, three. And repeat it again. Blue again. Repeat. <laughs> yes, buddy. I don't think I need to float the bananas anymore. Finally, <laughs> pulling off the win. And then, as this Oracle. Here you go. Yes! <laughs> Get clapped! Um. Nicely done, nicely done. It's been sideboarding. Okay, so against their deck, honestly, it's just engineered explosives that we can do. That's it. <laughs> um, we're just going to uh, concede the fact that they may be able to like hose us down. Um, Aether spell bomb's not that great. Brainstorm might not be that great, and then I think that's it. Um, we could also put in some metallic rebukes along that lines. Yeah, I think so. Mm, yeah, that's it. Fighting needles kind of good. Shadow sphere not so much. I don't see myself shadow fearing anytime soon ah, so good <laughs> um maybe we shave off a bubble 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 okay the drum is needed for the combo execution i realize now okay close the die roll and goes first they go first we're gonna keep here's a turn to turn turn one script show sure. here's my turn one aragavan uh, yeah sure yes let's go Okay. Oh, they don't have it. Coolness, coolness. It's first attack. Begin combat. Attack you. Let's steal some. Steal something. Okay. Oh, that's good to steal. Okay, I like that. I like that. Uh, this is just when what is this enchantments we control, but we don't have enough enchants enchantments for that. Here's a mox amber that we can cast. Here's a. Oh, in yes. Here's a emery. Okay, bring leaf mox ember and iteration. Can we go for an iteration right here? Sure, I think we can. Oh, that's a grinding station. But we we don't have anything here. So maybe we can go. Uh, you want to exile Urza Saga? I want grinding station in my hand. Saga to the bottom and Urza's uh, breach exiled because we already have sagas. Yep. That's cool. That's cool. That's. We just need to fighting needle this. Oh no, rest in peace. Okay. They rest in peace. Okay, okay, okay. So we're going a uh, different approach. That's a grinding station. We grind them. Go to main. We express our iteration. So engineered explosives or two. Okay. One to my hand, one to the bottom, one here. And drop. Then we're going to attack with everything. Okay, 15. Go so moon. <laughs> Forest X and fetch shock. Here's me engineered explosives for two. Here's blue, here's red. Done. <laughs> okay, I just need now a fighting needle and we're off to the races. Fighting needle! Yes! <laughs> oh, our opponent. <laughs> Now that was fun. Now, I would count my game one as a win, although we did time out. If you look at the board state, we actually are on the win right there. There is nothing that the opponent can do. We are just waiting for the inevit inevitability or the saga win or the grinding station win. They can't do anything about that. So for me, the deck stands as a 3-2. We did put it in the league right there. We lost to Tron. Um, that's because I think looking at the deck, that's the natural um, weakness 
weakness to this deck, spe specifically because they're playing main board hate in the form of Progenitus, Relic of Progenitus. And that's why we're actually packing Spreading Seas on the sideboard, three of them. If you ask me, four, four maybe might be a good number as well. We also lost to Titan, um, Primeval Titan, but I believe it's also down to luck uh, at that point in time. Uh, we didn't draw the correct lands that we needed. And at the same time, there was a turn where we could have gotten off on turn three. However, they were on the play. So that's why they got it off on turn three. All right. What are my thoughts on the deck? The deck is super fun to play. There is a I win scenario. Um, there is a time wherein you're just waiting to top deck uh, Underworld Breach. And what is the weakness of the deck? The deck felt that there is a, a huge lock factor here. And um, if you're just looking for the combo win as well, I think you need to go in uh, with the deck um, thinking about an incidental Underworld Breach win rather than the plan A. You want to have the RC and Ragavan your opening hand and some form of interaction just to divert your opponent's attention while you're actually building up that turn to Grinding Station and Underworld Breach your opponent. Um, I believe the sideboard could be uh, fine-tuned as well. Maybe think about putting in a bit more spreading seeds. But other than that, I think I need a bit more time to play with the deck. It's really fun and I do recommend All right, that's it for now. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up or consider subscribing. I also have a Patreon if you want to support your boy. I put in my thoughts on the deck more in-depth in terms of like the sideboarding plan, what's the progress of the deck right now, how many versions or iterations that I went through, what are the suggestions that you would like to make, special videos as well that I don't put into YouTube because it's a bit longer and um, I need to put it on a paywall per se. <laughs> also, if you want to catch me live, I am live on Twitch. Consider going in there. Also, check out my Discord. So that's it. If you enjoyed my videos, check out more videos here and here. And as always, stay safe, y'all. <laughs>